Hey, how's it going? John from Branson Cerakote here. I had something come up in training recently and also I've had a few messages on it over the last few months about, I guess, people's degreasing techniques. I won't get into the argument of what's better to degrease with, brake cleaner, acetone, simple green, whatever. Uh, we use acetone. It works for us. I'm not saying to do one thing or the other. However, what I have seen and I've kind of talked to people about is a lot of people will degrease They'll go to the sandblast cabinet or the oven, either, either one works. Then after it's sanded, they degrease again. You really don't want to do that because what ends up happening is if you've got any sediment or anything floating around in your acetone, you've now added that back to your metal with it being basically raw metal. All that etching and everything has taken any type of protective you know, layer that was made during this, the, the manufacturing process off of there. So that contaminants and stuff you have get in there and it actually is the opposite of what you want to have happen when you're degreasing something. One of the things I found from doing this for going on five years is this coating is not as fragile as a lot of people think it is as far as you know grease and things like or you know finger oils and things like that. I get that comment a lot. I get a lot of emails on not wearing gloves and things like that. It's just never been an issue. I've never had an adhesion issue. If you're degreasing something and you see a spot on there, take some acetone on a rag and wipe it off. Let it air dry and then go about your business. But it's, the stuff is not that temperamental or fragile. If you go back and add the contaminants out of your acetone, however, you're, you're taking that chance of having some kind of residue on there that'll prevent it from adhering. So don't do that. It's overkill. It's just really not that important. So I hope that helps. Um, as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And check us out at BrancisAeracote.com for all your stencil needs. Have a great day.